It's time for another exciting episode of the world's only game show, Shovelware's Brain Game! Wanted for many things, but not for murder, it's the Dancing Banana! Nonsense non sequiturs. Okay, look, I'm gonna level with you. I'm already running out of ideas for questions. I'm just going to play some white noise for the next 10 seconds and then throw some choices up on the screen just to pick from them at random. Probably geography. <laughs> I'm going over Niagara Falls in a barrel! Did you know that Niagara Falls is actually three separate waterfalls? I think I'm going down the largest one! What was the name of it again? It's lit, fam! Bleh, bleh, it's me, Count Dracula! The famous vampire! I want to suck your blood, and then pick your brain with trivia! Which actor portrayed what is widely considered to be the most iconic performance of the iconic character? Who I totally am! Garden Variety I've been reading up on the Venus flytrap and they seem super cool. I'd love to go visit them in their natural habitat. Where would that be exactly? <laughs> you stop that.
Artistic integrity. When working in computer graphics, artists sometimes unwrap the sides of a character or object to project additional detail and color onto it using an image called a texture. What is this process called? The power of music. As seen on TV, it's the all-new Dinner Blaster from Harkinian's Home Appliances. Setting the table got you down, cooking meals for the whole family, giving you arm cramps. Those worries are a thing of the past with this patented Dinner Blaster. Simply load up all the ingredients, take aim at the kitchen table, and you'll be the king of home cooking in no time. Never wonder what's for dinner again. This question is really gonna get him. And you know, if not, then let me get struck by... Oh, uh, a falling grand piano? <laughs> and live! Whoa! That was a close call. And now all of the keys are scattered everywhere. I guess I've got to clean this mess up. Uh, how many keys will I need to pick up in total? I give up. Science rules. There's a part of the cell known as the powerhouse because it generates energy for the rest of it. What is its name? Big laundry. So I've heard that Americans have this thing called a 10-gallon hat. <laughs> Do you think anyone has tried to actually fill it with water before? I mean, how many gallons of water can it hold, really? Off the mark! I don't like that.
The dancing banana makes me uncomfortable, but I, I can't quite pinpoint what it is about him. It's not his shape, and it's not his smell, though that is offensive in its own right. Oh, I know what it is. It's his color. That particular shade of yellow is just weird. What phobia must I have? <laughs> Good enough! Flags of the world. How many stripes are there on the flag of the United States of America? Good enough. Amazing space. You know, I just learned the other day that they don't consider Pluto a planet anymore. Can you believe that? All those big orbs in our solar system and suddenly, oh, this one doesn't count. Ah, I'm seriously ticked off here, man. Like if it's not a planet, then what the heck is it? You'll receive a round-trip travel compensation to the Marsh's grocery store location down the street. But that's not all. As a bonus, you'll also receive an exclusive look at my personal shopping list and the unspoken implication that I'm expecting you to return with the items written on it. We're running low on cheese, by the way. Congratulations! You're the winner of Shovelware's Brain Game! Would you look at that? We made it to the end of the episode with minimal casualties. I'd call that a successful game show taping. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't you? This episode is sponsored by Smart Technologies. For real, thanks fellas. <laughs>